all right everyone so i just wanted to come to you guys with this quick trade update and review um on yesterday on yesterday uh evening we did take a trade on the euro new zealand um based on the signal that we received on the daily chart the trade actually hit its take profit today so it took about 24 hours for this trade to actually hit its take profit and the trade uh actually uh was a profitable hundred and about 122 pips um profitable trade um on the euro new zealand okay so let me go over really quick what i saw give you guys a trade analysis and um explain to you why this trade was profitable okay so on yesterday we received this signal okay yeah this signal so this signal showed momentum starting to move to the upside on this pair um, we're at a level of support we can see right here where demand is also starting to form on the pair and on our momentum oscillators on the overbought oversold oscillator we were crossing the 30 level and on the tdi that i use in conjunction with this with this with the overbought oversold oscillator we was crossing over the 32 level okay so once I received that signal, I was um, ready, almost ready to go ahead and take a trade, um, a trade to the upside. But I didn't take it as of yet. You know, still have to analyze and look at a few things to make sure this is a trade that we want. So once I did receive the signal, knowing that we could potentially get a trade, I went ahead and just put in my stop loss. Just put in a level where the stop loss could potentially be. And it always, for me, the stop loss is usually at the swing low, the swing low of the, um, of the of the uh day that the day the previous swing low of the area that i'm trying to trade okay so that's that was my um potential stop loss and then here, down here you, you can see the actual stop loss of the trade 1.65206 this is the actual trade right here i'm gonna drag this onto the chart in a second so you guys can see exactly what took place in the trade um and then i go ahead and put in a potential entry so here is the day that closed uh, my potential entry was right here, right? So I plot these in just to get a better um, analysis of where I potentially want to enter the trade. But my actual entry on this trade was at 1.66181. And again, I'm going to drag this on shortly and show you guys the actual trade. So let's go down to the four-hour chart because as you guys know, if you've been following the strategy so far, you know on the four-hour chart is where I go to go ahead and button up my stop loss try to get it as tight as possible without breaking the um swing low or swing high depending on which which direction i'm trading in i also go in and put in my potential entry now guys look i put in the potential entry here because i know we probably don't see all of this yet so it's kind of like where i was um when i when i'm looking at when i was looking at the trade uh, you'll see it a little bit better on the one hour chart but mainly for the four hour chart i go in and, and tighten up my um stop loss so let's go over to the one hour chart and look at trade entry all right here we go so this is this is the current day right here this is this is yesterday this is before 5 p.m eastern standard time um actually today because you know at 5 p.m eastern standard time we go over to the new trading day which is taking place right here but this is actually today this is the day that actually hit the take profit but this is the day right here we move this out of the way this line right here see the line starts right there this is where yesterday started right so here is what i was seeing here's here's what i was seeing before i even before i even took the trade before i even entered the trade so i saw this I saw so yesterday I would have saw let's see okay this is what time did I get home around 8 so this is 11 12 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so I got so I actually I actually got in it got home and looked at this trade around this time right here right so the price had already pulled back so I just set a potential uh, entry order. I took a um, a buy order right here. I put a level, I believe it was a buy stop order, something like that, right here. Um, again, my stop loss was down here. 
right, I place the stop loss down here. I usually trade a one-to-one -one risk to reward ratio. So my take profit was somewhere in this range right here. 100 and some uh, 120 pips, right? It's one-to-one -to, -one to wherever the stop loss is. So, so there it is. So as you can see, on, on, on this morning, price came up, probably hit put me in the trade, pulled back a little bit, and boom. Because we're using daily momentum, straight to the take profit. As a matter of fact, let me put in the exact coordinates of where these positions were. At least the entry and the um, take profit. So the entry would have been 1.66181. 1.66181. One point six six one eight one. Boom. That's my entry. Take profit. One point six seven four five six. This is where my take profit was right here. So price entered right here, and it and it came out for about one hundred and twenty six pips on that trade that was taken and the trade uh, hit its take profit in one day. So, here we go. Now, I'm gonna drag the actual trade right onto the chart right now. Cause with using MT4, you can actually put the trade on the chart after the trade closes. So boom, there it is. There it is, I just drug it onto the chart. You can see my entry, you can see my take profit, and you can see, well, I just left the stop loss. Well, this little yellow line right here, this little red dot right here represents the stop loss. It represents that stop loss. So that's the trade, guys. That was the trade right there. Um, we, we actually executed the trade. It went and hit, it hit the take profit and for 126 pips, one trade this week. Um, I, ha I also have another trade going um, right now. It's probably, if it hits to take profit, I believe it's about another 100 pips. That's about 220 pips on the week. I probably won't trade any more than that this week. Probably look for some nice uh, potential reversal setups um, for next week. But again, just wanted to go over a quick analysis of this trade. This was another profitable trade. Um, trading the new level, the new level strategy. So if you guys are interested in this strategy, um, like the page, share the page, leave a comment, um, and I'll hit you back. Have a good day.